Our planet is teeming with unique animals, each playing a vital role in keeping our ecosystems in harmony. Yet, a handful of them are like rare gems, barely holding on due to habitat loss, climate change, and human activity. From lush rainforests to the deep sea, join us on a journey to uncover the mysteries of the rarest animals on Earth. Twenty. Saola. The Saola is often called the Asian unicorn. This is because of its mysterious nature. It is a rare and critically endangered species found in the Anamite range of Vietnam and Laos. This antelope-like mammal was discovered in 1992, making it one of the most recently identified large mammals. The Saola is recognized by its long, straight horns and distinctive white facial markings. Despite its uniqueness, this species is under immediate threat mainly due to habitat loss. Agriculture and human settlement are encroaching on its forest habitat, and there's additional risk from hunting and snaring intended for other wildlife. The Saola is so rare and secretive that confirmed sightings in the wild are extremely rare. Its elusive behavior, combined with the challenging terrain of its habitat, makes studying and conserving the species particularly challenging. Conservation efforts for the Saola focus on preserving its habitat, implementing anti-poaching measures, and engaging with local communities. Conservationists work to establish protected areas and raise awareness about the importance of protecting this species. The Saola's conservation status remains critical, emphasizing the need for intensified efforts to save this unique and almost mythical creature from the brink of extinction. 19. Vaquita the vaquita is the tiniest and most endangered porpoise globally. It is in a tough fight for survival in the northern waters of the Gulf of California, Mexico. With a population on the edge of extinction, it's estimated that only a few are left in the wild, making it one of the rarest marine mammals on Earth. The main threat to the vaquita comes from accidentally getting caught in illegal gillnets used for fishing the totoaba fish. This is a prized species in traditional Chinese medicine. The demand for Totoaba swim bladders, believed to have medicinal properties, has created a lucrative black market. And of course, this has worsened the vaquita's situation. Despite international conservation efforts, including a ban on gillnet fishing in the vaquita's habitat, the population continues to decline. Conservationists and government bodies have taken various steps to save the vaquita from extinction. These efforts involve patrolling and monitoring the Gulf of California, enforcing fishing bans, and using alternative fishing gear to reduce accidental catches. Additionally, there are ongoing initiatives to raise awareness about the critical situation of the vaquita and gather support for its conservation. 18. Sumatran Orangutan The Sumatran Orangutan is found on the Indonesian island of Sumatra. This ape is critically endangered and fighting for survival. Among the three existing species of orangutans, it's recognized by its darker fur and more long-haired appearance compared to its Bornean relatives. The most significant threat to the Sumatran orangutan comes from habitat loss due to illegal logging, palm oil plantations, and human encroachment. The destruction of their rainforest home not only breaks up populations, but also isolates individuals. It makes them more vulnerable and limits genetic diversity. Palm oil plantation expansion in particular has played a major role in deforestation, bringing these primates dangerously close to extinction. Conservation is vital for the Sumatran orangutan's survival. Initiatives include protecting their habitat, launching reforestation projects, and engaging communities to promote sustainable practices. Conservation organizations collaborate with local communities to spread awareness about the critical importance of preserving these endangered primates and their habitats. 17. Amur Leopard The Amur Leopard is a critically endangered big cat species only found in the dense forests of the Russian Far East and parts of China. It is easily identified by its stunning golden yellow fur adorned with distinctive dark rosettes. With just a handful of individuals left in the wild, these leopards face the looming threat of extinction. Habitat loss, fueled by logging, agricultural expansion, and infrastructure development, poses a serious challenge to the armor leopard's survival. 
On top of that, poaching for their beautiful fur and bones, driven by the illegal wildlife trade, further endangers these majestic cats. The combination of these threats has pushed the Amur leopard to the brink, with estimates suggesting that only around 100 individuals remain in the wild. International conservation efforts are in motion to rescue the Amur leopard from extinction. Initiatives include protecting their habitat, implementing anti-poaching measures, and involving communities in conservation programs. Establishing protected areas and corridors is crucial. That allows these solitary creatures to roam and find mates, and ultimately aids genetic diversity. 16. Northern Hairy-Nosed Wombat The Northern Hairy-Nosed Wombat is an Australian marsupial. It is in a critical fight for survival. This wombat species is among the rarest mammals globally, with a small population restricted to a limited area in Epping Forest National Park in Queensland. The main threat to the northern hairy-nosed wombat is habitat loss. The transformation of its natural grassland habitat into farmland has significantly reduced its range and food sources. Additionally, competition with introduced species like rabbits adds to the challenges faced by this already endangered species. Comprehensive conservation efforts for the northern hairy-nosed wombat include habitat protection, research, and community engagement. Fencing has been put in place to shield their remaining habitat from encroaching livestock, and monitoring programs aim to understand their behavior and reproductive patterns. Successful translocation programs have introduced a small population to a second protected site to reduce the risk of a catastrophic event wiping out the entire species. Despite these efforts, the northern hairy-nosed wombat remains on the brink of extinction, highlighting the vulnerability of certain species in the face of habitat destruction and human-induced pressures. Continued dedication to conservation measures and spreading awareness about the importance of protecting unique and endangered species are vital elements in the fight to ensure the ongoing existence of the northern hairy-nosed wombat and other threatened wildlife 15. Rare Baby Goat A baby goat born in San Luis Province, Argentina, drew widespread attention due to its unusual appearance, a fusion of human-like facial features and a goat's physique. The creature exhibited disconcerting protruding eyes and a flattened face, prompting astonishment among locals when images surfaced online, swiftly spreading across social media platforms. Tragically, the anomaly survived merely three hours before passing away, despite efforts to nurture it. Ovedo, the owner of the goat, recounted discovering the rare baby goat in their family field shortly after birth. Recalling the distressing sight, Ovedo noted the striking discrepancy between the kid's facial structure and its otherwise ordinary goat body. Struggling to comprehend the situation, Ovedo attempted to provide sustenance to the distressed creature using a spoon. However, within a few hours, its condition deteriorated rapidly, leading to its untimely demise. The haunting images captured by Ovedo's daughter-in-law swiftly gained widespread attention, sparking intense curiosity and discussions across various online platforms. Reports indicate that the striking images of the deformed goat reached local authorities, prompting the dispatch of an officer to document this unique occurrence. The owner of the goat expressed bewilderment regarding the cause behind the birth of the goat with such extraordinary features. She emphasized that this was an unprecedented event within their locality, leaving her at a loss for an explanation regarding the anomaly. 14. Seneca White Deer Seneca White Deer are famous for dashing across roads. Unlike common brown-coated deer, this rare variation isn't easily spotted in the wild or on the highway. What sets them apart is their unique white coat, making them stand out from the typical brown fur of white-tailed deer. These special deer lack the pigmentation that would normally make their fur brown, although it doesn't affect their eye color. You can only find the Seneca white deer at the former Seneca Army Depot in Seneca County, New York. This is where they were first seen in 1949. Their survival is well protected on the depot since hunting these white deer has been banned since their discovery. Despite this protection, they remain a rare breed. Studies spanning the last 60 years estimate that only around 300 of these beautiful creatures exist today. For those eager to catch a glimpse, the Seneca white deer can be observed by the public on site at the former Seneca Army Depot in New York. 
but only under official supervision. 13. Yangtze River Dolphin The Yangtze River Dolphin, also known as the Baiji, was a freshwater cetacean native to the Yangtze River in China. Unfortunately, it's now considered functionally extinct, with no confirmed sightings since the early 2000s. Once revered as the goddess of the Yangtze, the decline of the Baiji reflects the severe impact of human activities on aquatic ecosystems. The Baiji faced numerous threats leading to its demise, including habitat degradation, industrialization, pollution, shipping traffic, and overfishing. The completion of the Three Gorges Dam in 2006 further disrupted the river's ecosystem and accelerated the Baiji's decline by altering its habitat and reducing prey availability. Saving the Baiji proved challenging given the vastness of the Yangtze River and the complex interplay of various threats. Despite conservation efforts, such as protected areas and attempts to establish reserves for the Baiji, the species continued to decline disappearing from the natural scene. 12. Philippine Eagle The Philippine Eagle is the national bird of the Philippines. It is also one of the world's rarest and largest eagles. It has a majestic appearance with a distinctive crown of feathers. Sadly, it is critically endangered, facing multiple threats to its existence. Deforestation, driven by logging, agricultural expansion, and human settlement, poses a significant challenge for the Philippine eagle. This has drastically reduced its natural habitat, forcing the eagles into isolated pockets of forest. Additionally, hunting and illegal trapping add to the threats faced by the already shrinking population. Efforts to save the Philippine eagle are varied. Primarily, it involves habitat protection, community engagement, and captive breeding programs. Protected areas and reserves aim to safeguard the remaining forests crucial for the eagle's survival. Conservationists work closely with local communities to encourage sustainable practices and raise awareness about the importance of protecting this iconic species. Captive breeding programs like those by the Philippine Eagle Foundation play a crucial role in the eagle's conservation. These programs not only contribute to the eagle's population growth, but also serve as a means of education and awareness for the public. 11. Angel Shark The angel shark, with its distinctive flat body and wing-like fins, is a fascinating species found in the coastal waters of the northeastern Atlantic and the Mediterranean Sea. Its angelic appearance is striking, but sadly, these creatures are facing significant threats that have led to a steep decline in their populations. Overfishing, habitat destruction, and accidental capture in fishing gear pose substantial risks to the angel shark. Their flat bodies make them especially vulnerable to getting entangled in trawl nets and other fishing gear designed for bottom-dwelling species. The International Union for Conservation of Nature has classified the angel shark as critically endangered, emphasizing the urgent need for conservation action. Initiatives focus on protecting the angel shark and its habitat, including establishing marine protected areas and developing sustainable fishing practices. 10. Mountain Gorilla The mountain gorilla is a captivating and endangered primate species. This great ape calls the volcanic slopes and dense forests of the Virunga Massif in Central Africa home, spanning Rwanda, Uganda, and the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Known for their robust build, distinctive black fur, and expressive eyes, these gorillas are one of two subspecies of the Eastern Gorilla. Despite their iconic status, mountain gorillas have faced severe threats from habitat loss, human encroachment, and regional instability. Conservation efforts have played a crucial role in their survival, contributing to a notable increase in their population over the past few decades. Diane Fossey's groundbreaking work in gorilla conservation brought global attention to the challenges faced by mountain gorillas. Her efforts inspired coordinated efforts to protect their habitat and address human-wildlife conflict. Conservation initiatives include establishing protected areas, community-based projects, and ecotourism programs that offer sustainable economic benefits to local communities. Collaboration between governments, 
conservation organizations and local communities has been key to the recovery of the mountain gorilla population. Strict protection measures and habituation programs enable responsible and controlled tourism, providing a unique opportunity for visitors to witness these magnificent creatures in their natural environment while ensuring their well-being. 9. Kakapo. The kakapo is also known as the night parrot or owl parrot. This bird is a unique nocturnal parrot native to New Zealand. Loved for its charming and charismatic personality, the kakapo holds the distinction of being one of the world's rarest and heaviest parrot species. Notably, it's the only parrot that can't fly. It relies on powerful legs for ground mobility. The kakapo's decline can be traced to various factors. These include habitat destruction, introduced predators, and the impacts of European colonization. Its adaptation to a predator-free lifestyle left it vulnerable when rats, cats, and stoats were introduced to New Zealand. By the 1990s, the kakapo population had sharply declined. This prompted the launch of an intensive conservation effort, the Kakapo Recovery Program, a collaboration with the New Zealand Department of Conservation focuses on habitat protection, predator control, and a unique breeding program. Thanks to these dedicated efforts, the Kakapo population has slowly increased, offering a glimmer of hope for the species. 8. Madagascar Pochard The Madagascar Pochard is a unique and highly endangered diving duck found exclusively in Madagascar. It has the most striking black and white plumage. Once believed extinct, a small population was rediscovered in 2006, sparking hope for its conservation. Habitat loss and degradation, driven by deforestation, wetland drainage, and invasive species, pose significant threats to the Madagascar Pochard. Human activities like agriculture and development have contributed to the decline of crucial wetland habitats essential for the duck's survival. Additionally, introduced species such as tilapia and predatory fish have further impacted the duck's breeding grounds. Conservation efforts for the Madagascar pochard are diverse, including habitat restoration, community engagement, and captive breeding programs. Organizations like the Wildfowl and Wetlands Trust play a crucial role in these initiatives. Conservationists work to protect and restore wetlands, promote sustainable land use practices, and raise awareness among local communities about the importance of preserving this unique species. Captive breeding programs, like those by the Durrell Wildlife Conservation Trust, aim to boost the Madagascar pochard population in a controlled environment before potential reintroduction to the wild. These programs serve as a safety net for the species while addressing ongoing threats to its natural habitat. 7. Greater Bamboo Lima the Greater Bamboo Lima is an endangered primate found only in the rainforests of southeastern Madagascar and is known for its unique bamboo-focused diet. Sadly, this lima is under serious threat due to habitat loss caused by deforestation and expanding agriculture. With its distinctive appearance, featuring a dark coat and striking white ear tufts, the Greater Bamboo Lima symbolizes Madagascar's exceptional biodiversity. The extensive clearing of its natural habitat for agriculture, logging, and charcoal production has significantly reduced the availability of suitable bamboo forests, directly impacting the lemur's survival. To prevent further decline, conservation efforts for the greater bamboo lemur are crucial. These include protecting habitats, planting new forests, and engaging communities in sustainable land use practices. Organizations like the Madagascar Biodiversity Partnership work towards finding a balance between human needs and the preservation of vital lemur habitats. Six. Hawksbill turtle. The hawksbill turtle, a critically endangered sea turtle species found in tropical and subtropical oceans, is known for its unique overlapping scales on its shell. This turtle symbolizes the beauty of marine life and the urgent call for conservation. The main threat to the hawksbill turtle is the illegal trade of its stunning shell, called tortoise shell. Despite international bans, the demand for tortoiseshell products used in jewelry and ornaments fuels illegal hunting and trafficking. 
combined with habitat loss, accidental capture in fishing gear, and climate change affecting nesting sites, these factors have brought the species to the brink of extinction. Conservation efforts for the hawksbill turtle are extensive. They include protecting nesting sites, promoting turtle-friendly fishing practices, and international collaborations to combat illegal trade. Strict regulations like those by the Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild Fauna and Flora aim to curb the illegal trafficking of hawksbill products. 5. Hirola. The Hirola is also known as Hunter's Hartebeest. This rare and critically endangered antelope species lives in the border areas of Kenya and Somalia. Recognized by its distinctive lyre-shaped horns and reddish-brown coat, the Hirola is among the most endangered large mammals in Africa. The primary threat to the Hirola population is habitat loss. This is intensified by overgrazing, charcoal production, and agricultural expansion. The antelope's limited range and specific habitat needs make it highly susceptible to environmental changes. Additionally, competition with domestic livestock for limited resources adds to the challenges faced by this species. Preserving the Hirola is crucial to prevent its extinction. Conservation efforts involve restoring habitats, implementing community-based programs, and monitoring remaining populations. Organizations like the Hirola Conservation Program collaborate with local communities to encourage sustainable land use practices and raise awareness about protecting this unique antelope species. 4. Pygmy Three-Toed Sloth the pygmy three-toed sloth is an exceptional and critically endangered species residing on the small, isolated Isla Escudo de Veraguas off the coast of Panama. This sloth species is known for its petite size, leisurely movements, and unique adaptation to its mangrove forest home. The primary threats to the pygmy three-toed sloth stem from habitat degradation and human activities. The sloth's limited range and the destruction of its mangrove habitat through logging and development pose significant challenges to its survival. The sloth's specific dependence on red mangrove leaves for sustenance adds to the risks, given the vulnerability of these trees to disturbance. Conservation efforts for the pygmy three-toed sloth prioritize habitat protection. Constant scientific research and community engagement are starting to yield results too. Establishing protected areas and implementing sustainable management practices are vital aspects of these initiatives. Researchers delve into the sloth's behavior, ecology, and population dynamics to shape conservation strategies and deepen our understanding of this unique species. Local communities play a pivotal role in pygmy three-toed sloth conservation. Adopting sustainable practices and promoting responsible tourism contribute to safeguarding its delicate habitat. The species' status as one of the world's most endangered sloths underscores the ongoing need for collaborative efforts to ensure its future and preserve the biodiversity of this remote and ecologically significant island. 3. Honduran Ghost Bat the Honduran ghost bat is a fascinating and mysterious bat species native to the neotropical regions of Central and South America. Also known as the white bat, its name perfectly describes its unique appearance. It has a snow-white coat and translucent wings and ears. These distinctive features give the bat an ethereal and ghostly look. The Honduran ghost bat is mainly tree-dwelling. It makes roosts in the leaves of large tropical plants, especially heliconias. During the day, these bats wrap themselves in the large, unfurled leaves, creating a sheltered roost referred to as a tent. This behavior not only shields them from predators, but also helps regulate their body temperature. Despite their captivating traits and intriguing habits, we know relatively little about the Honduran ghost bat. It is elusive, and its habitat poses a myriad of challenges. Threats to this species typically include habitat loss, particularly the destruction of tropical forests and the heliconias they rely on. Then there are potential impacts from pesticide use and agricultural practices. Conservation efforts for the Honduran ghost bat face obstacles due to the limited information available about its ecology and population dynamics. Ongoing research, habitat protection, and raising awareness about the significance of preserving these unique bats and their habitats are essential for ensuring the survival of this enigmatic and mysterious species. 2. Red Wolf 
The red wolf is a critically endangered canid species native to the southeastern United States. It is known for its reddish-brown coat and is one of the world's most endangered wolf species. The red wolf's history is challenging, marked by conservation struggles to save it from the edge of extinction. In the past, the red wolf confronted habitat loss, predator control programs, and hybridization with coyotes. This caused a significant drop in its population. By the 1970s, red wolves were declared extinct in the wild. This prompted the initiation of a captive breeding program to preserve the remaining individuals. In the 1980s, the Red Wolf Recovery Program was launched. This program is dedicated to reintroducing red wolves into their native habitats. The program encountered various challenges, including ongoing habitat fragmentation, disease, and conflicts with humans. Nonetheless, red wolves showcased adaptability and are starting to establish themselves in designated recovery areas. 1. California Condor The California Condor is a symbol of both conservation success and the ongoing challenges faced by endangered species. Boasting a wingspan exceeding 9 feet, the California Condor is among the largest flying birds globally. It is native to the western United States. On the brink of extinction in the late 20th century, the California Condor confronted threats like lead poisoning from ingesting spent lead ammunition, habitat destruction, and micro-trash ingestion. In 1987, the last remaining wild individuals were captured. This marked the start of an intensive captive breeding program. Collaborative efforts involving the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service, the California Condor Recovery Program, and various conservation organizations successfully boosted the condor population through captive breeding. Reintroduction efforts took flight in the 1990s, releasing condors into the wild, primarily in California and Arizona. Despite progress, challenges endure. Wild birds are particularly susceptible to lead poisoning from ingesting spent lead ammunition in carcasses. Conservationists persist in addressing this threat, advocating for non-lead ammunition use and providing medical intervention for lead-exposed condors. That's the end of our fascinating journey today. Which of these rare animals grabbed you the most? Let us know in the comments. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more videos that we made, click on one on the screen or take a look at the channel. Thanks for watching, and see you next time. For now though, we're out of here. Catch you in the next video.